Hello everybody, I'm HBL from HBL TV and welcome back to a new video. Now today's video is going to be a little bit more serious. It's not really going to be a funny video, it's going to be a little bit more of an interesting video. This is something that I've wanted to talk about for a while and so I'm deciding to finally talk about it now. And what that is, is my experience with promotional videos. Have you ever seen a promotional video to some sort of sleepaway camp or family resort and you think to yourself, Wow, that's amazing, there's no way it's that good. And you'd be right, because they're bullshit. I'm not saying all of them are. But the promo video for the sleepaway camp that I went to was complete bullshit. Basically, I used to go to this sleepaway camp for this video, we'll call it Turtle Lake, right? And by the way, this video is not to shit on Turtle Lake. It was an overall pretty nice experience. I've made a lot of great friends there, I got my first girlfriend, and I overall just had a lot of fun experiences there. This is just a video telling you that you shouldn't take everything at face value. Not everything is always as it seems. When I first saw the promotional video for Turtle Lake, I couldn't believe it. They made it seem like it was this amazing paradise. They even had interviews with the kids there talking about how awesome it was. So I went. One of the years I went there was the year that they were shooting the update promotional video. It had been a good seven or eight years since they shot the first one, and I don't blame them for shooting another one because they had made a lot of progress with the camp. They expanded the area, they added a bunch more stuff, they had a lot to show off, right? Again, I didn't have a bad experience, it just wasn't as great as they portrayed it. The camp did have some flaws. For example, the drinking water there was nasty. So on visiting day, they had bottled water everywhere to try to keep the parents from drinking it. So anyway, when they were shooting the video, they had some of the kids be interviewed. And one of the kids in my bunk was interviewed, and after we were talking about it, and he was like, yeah, they would correct me at certain times. Like if they asked, how's the food here, and I said good, they would be like, no, 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 say great. Kind of not telling him to lie, but telling him to exaggerate a bit. Also, and to be clear, this is just a rumor. I'm not saying this is true. This is something that I heard from someone in my bunk. Apparently, there was an email sent out during the winter with like a 50 question test kind of for the kids to fill out. Now, I guess they only sent it to certain people because I don't remember my parents getting it. It was an opinionated test about the camp, but there were right and wrong answers. Say so the question was, how do you feel about this camp? A, I don't like it. B, it's all right. C, I kind of like it, or D, I love it. D would be the right answer. And I heard that you had to get at least 49 of those 50 questions correct if you wanted to be interviewed for the video. But they didn't just mess with the interview. The camera people would go around camp filming people, and so I remember my group was in the canteen, and the camera people were there shooting. Now about five feet to my right, there are a few kids playing foosball, and the camera guy walks over, and he starts like telling them to fake stuff. He's like, all right, I want you to smile, and then you two high five. Kind of just telling them to fake being happy which I thought was kind of scummy and I was annoyed because he was having them do stuff that I remember seeing in the video and thinking oh that's real but turns out it wasn't and before you call me gullible for believing it I was nine years old when I first watched that video so yeah that's gonna be it for this video again this video was not made to bash the camp thank you guys for watching this video if you enjoyed please leave a like and subscribe if you're new I will see you in the next video bye make it make sense make it make sense I can't hide a heart in the black tent I you were off the bullshit